Hello everyone, it's Joseph, and welcome back to part 2 of how to build CCPD from the Flash inside of Minecraft. And this is what we will be building today. So, as we go inside of the building, this is my other world, but we are going to build the first room right here. Then we will build these two elevators, which will eventually go up to the top. Then a hallway that leads all the way up to the main part that you see in the TV show over here. Alright guys, so the materials you'll need for this build is some bl block of gold, calcite, dark prismarine, sea lantern, iron trap door, oak wood stairs, dark oak door, and the night vision is optional just so I can see the inside and it's more pleasant for you guys to um, watch when I build. Alright, so first thing you want to do is go straight into the building and you want to get your prismarine dark, uh, dark prismarine block and just carry this out straight across on either side just like that next get your calcite and these two cavities right here you want to fill them both in with just calcite just all the way over just like that all right next you want to get You want to go, I believe, right here and place one block here, one block there. Then place Royal Calcite, three Dark Prismarine, Calcite, two, another Calcite on top of that. So you should have like, this little diamond shape. Then you want to cover up the dark prismarine like this. Then do it again with the calcite. And then do it once more with your dark prismarine block. Just like that. So when you come up, it should look kind of like a, an O. Or like a zero. Next, you want to go up one, two on both sides. One, two. Place a block to break it and go one, two, three. Then fill the rest in with calcite, making sure to leave this wall just empty. I forgot to get one material, which will just be a uh, smooth sandstone. So you can just pick block that if you don't have it already. And what you could do with that is um, go a block away from this from this wall right here, and just go. Uh, straight up it doesn't really matter I would suggest going up about I would say that up to there and then the ceiling will be worked on later so just do that for reference on both sides um, and then I'll tell you where the uh, ceiling for this is gonna be you could obviously just leave this open but there would be so much more area so I'm pretty sure I fill it in at this line, but I would wait until later in the episode to just know for sure what we are doing with that. It's better be safe than sorry, as I tell everyone. So if you're wondering why we are building it like that, we are doing that so that we could get my dark prismarine. And I believe I'm doing this right, but it doesn't seem to add up. Very weird, very weird. Um. Oh, that's right, guys. Don't worry about that. Um... I made a bit of a mistake, so you just break, um, break, break this. Do you don't need the uh, the line there? You can break these lines. So th what I just told you to do, don't do that. Um, I might cut this from the video, but if I don't, then that's fine. But what you want to do now is um, just break this corner off. You don't need this corner. Um, I forgot I did that in the original. Uh, I don't know why I did it, but I did. Um, I guess. I did, I, when I was building it originally, I didn't put those pillars there like I did in the t other tutorial. But, carrying on, you want to get your uh, dark prismarine. And then just connect up to there. That's why I needed this little crevice. So, hopefully you guys didn't get tripped up before. I'm going to go through a little recap. So, the building, the little line I told you to build um, up to the ceiling there, you could break that. And then you could also break the corner so the two double sides are exposed like that. Um... 
and you don't have any corners. Hopefully that wasn't too confusing for you guys. Then you want to do pretty much the same thing, but not breaking anything. But you want to get your calcite, go all the way like this, and just go up. And do that on either side so it looks symmetrical. Perfect. You guys are doing amazing. Then you want to grab your calcite again, go around in a circle just around the perimeter of the, the dark prismarine and the, the wall. Then go around with some dark prismarine, just like this. And then put fill that in with calcite, just like that. Same thing on this side. Just fill this around. And then your prismarine. And then the calcite. Don't mind the windy noises in the background. That's just the wind. You are also going to need one more material that I forgot to mention before. I am so sorry. Um, you're going to need some oak, dark oak, uh, just regular oak slabs um, you could put on. So you want to go put a place a block to move on so you can get an upside, upside, upside down stair. Do the same on that side. So it's inside the dark prismarine block. Then get your slabs. Go across as a little kind of bench thing that you'll be building. And that should be perfect, guys. You guys are doing so well. I'm so proud of you guys. So then... Next, what you want to do is get your calcite and place a block to remove it. Go up and go across like that. Next, you want to grab your gold and go in from a block. Place one, put, skip a block, one, another block, one, another block, one. And it should, if you can bit fit four like this, then you're doing everything perfectly and it's all going to plan. Next, we're going to go one, two, three, like that. And then add one more on each. If I want this is, this is the gold eagle that is on the photo thing. But it doesn't really look like an eagle. It looks like a turtle on this one. And then, so if you can if you can find a way to change it up and make it look better, uh, let me know in the comments. Uh, so go, then you want to go on this row. Go one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So then it should look kind of like that. Put a block there. You're gonna have to place a block to remove it so place one put a block up there break that block and go up by that do the same exact thing on this side so you'll be doing this like, just like that next you want to place a block to remove it again and you can break it like that so there's a little floating thing above his head and then you can put two on either side so it'll be a total of five next what you can do is get your calcite go all the way up and go up two blocks above this so you can have a full thing around it. And it's not actually touching the uh, that thing up there um, in this little area. Then you can get your sea lanterns. Go two blocks in from this and go one, two, three, four, five. Then underneath, put some iron trap doors just so it has like a little light effect and looks kind of cool. Then again on the back, you want to place a block to remove it. So you place a block down here. Put another thing up there. And then you want to fill in the hole back just like this. And once you're done filling that up, you will see what this effect does to the front. And it's not all just hollow all around it. So you, you find like that. You can just sip some more of my, um, my night vision. There you go. So there you go. It'll look exactly like that. And that is perfect. That's exactly what you want. Um while building this thing um actually from there you can well, we're about the ceiling later i was about to work on the ceiling but i realized let's just do that later because it could be pretty complex for some people so you know next one get some calcite place a block to remove it so it looks like that go straight up to the top right here perfect then you want to put one two three blocks of gold Put a block of calcite, then place a block to remove it, and then another three blocks of gold. Then you're gonna go over by one, two, three. And then I'm gonna go over by two blocks and fill that up all the way up there. Next, you're gonna go by six gold. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Then do that for three rows so it lines up, oopsie, perfectly like this. And then feel free to get your calcite and just fill this all the way up to the top. 
just like that. The same exact thing on this. Just uh, what the heck did I just say there? Uh, do the same exact thing on this side. So place block to remove it. Go straight up. Then you're gonna place one, two, three. Calcite block. Place block to remove it, and then one, two, three on the gold. Then one, two, three. Then one, two, three, four, five, six. And then fill in for three. Put calcite on the top. And then go by two blocks again. Because they're doing amazing. Perfect. Then you can grab your smooth sandstone block. What you can do is go up to the top. And then fill in the entire layer. Now what I actually might do is leave that so mobs don't spawn around. If you're in a survival world, you can still have some light on the inside if you wanted. Um, and fill it all up so it's all symmetrical and it doesn't look any weirder than <laughs> it probably already does because my tutorials are kind of whack. Um, but yeah, you can fill all of this in. Now, what you might notice um, with the windows is that you may see some lines coming in there, which I don't really know how to do anything about that. But what you could do, if you did, if you didn't enjoy seeing that, um, you could just put like a whole row of black concrete on the windows, so they're like kind of like fake windows, and you know. But for me, it doesn't really matter, so that's why I am continuing to do this like this. So you want to go like this? Oopsie. Continue to build it all out and make yourself a ceiling just like this. So, yeah, you can work on the ceiling, and then you should have your first room done of CCPD on the interior. But before I forget, because I literally almost forgot, I'm gonna go down from this right where this little hole was, this hallway, go straight down, leave a two block gap. Put some calcite, then an oak door, so you can go in and out, like that. Do the same exact thing on this side, just like that. Put a block of calcite, then put your dark oak door. And now we are going to work on the elevators. So you want to go one block, right? Then one, one. Then go one, 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 one. Like that. In the middle, put some calcite. Have a border of this. Dark prismarine. Then one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, 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 one, two. Then grab your smooth sandstone. Go around. Oopsie. Don't do that. Don't do that either. <laughs> Go down like this. Put sea lantern, iron trap door, right on top. So you should have this little elevator, and you do the same exact thing over here. So this will be a recap. One, two, three. One, two. One, two, and one. Calcite. All. Oopsie. Then go dark prismarine all around. One two 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 all like this. Drop down some smooth sandstone just all the way around, just like that. And there you go. And that is the first room that you will have in this whole build complete. Congratulations guys, you did that. Um now I'm doing one room at a time, so I gotta get my dimensions from my other rooms. But, like I said, I was going to forget some things, and I forgot to do something. <laughs> I am so sorry about that. So, how we can fix that is go, I think it's, how many blocks is that? It looks like four. So, one, two, three, four on five. Put a double block like that, and then fill it in just like that. What you can do is actually make it three. It just looks better. Then, same thing. You want to go to the bottom of this. Go all the way down. We have a two block gap like that so it still lines up and then do it like that so it's like that 
Same thing on this side. So you can do the top this time. It doesn't really matter. But keep it a two block gap from the wall. So it's one, two. But they all still line up. Then fin finishing touch. Iron trap doors all along that. The iron trap doors are optional. You don't need them. But I just think it looks a little bit better. Especially with what, you, what it looks like. You know. All right. Let me get my uh, new things for what I need, um, my new dimensions, and I will see. All right, guys, for this next part of the build, you'll need some white concrete, green concrete, calcite, oak wood stairs, oak wood slab, oak wood planks, and a dark oak door. Now, this one's going to be pretty long, and it's just kind of repetitive, so stick along, and you will be just fine. All right, so you wanna... don't break the door. Do not do that. That's something you don't want to do. Um, open the door. And great, my um, <laughs> if you guys do have night vision, make sure you use that pretty well. Um, so yeah. Then off of this block, you want to go one, two, three, four, five. So it should in all line up with um that. And then you want to go all the way down with your calcite all the way just like this so it goes up to the wall but at the end of the wall you want to go one two three just like that and don't touch it next you want to grab your green concrete you're gonna go one two and then on the third one go white then you want to place a block to remove it and the same thing over here with this wall Go up two. On the top one, go with white. And you should be looking pretty good right here, as expected. Next, you want to get your green your calcite. And you want to go down with for eleven blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Then bring that down with the three. Then you can get your green concrete, bring this all the way over, doubled, then on the top, put some white concrete, just like that. Then you can get your oak wood stairs, go one, two, three, go up one, one, two, three, and then you could go up another one. I miscalculated something, what you don't want to do is um, you want to actually break one row off of this so in total this will be 10 so it'll be 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 oh never mind i just miscounted that um i i put 12 for some reason um i think that was mainly because i we we put this block here before and that kind of tricked me so please go back and check that from here all the way to here is 11. It has to be 11. So go back and check that and come back when you're ready. Next, we're going to go 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. And 1, 2, 3. Then get your oak planks and go for 9 blocks in total right here. Perfect. Then you want to go 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Oopsie. And then 1, 2, 3. Put another uh, three by three square like this. And then you want to go up again. Um, place a block to remove it. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now you could keep these blocks underneath, but I'm not going to because you're not going to see it. So it doesn't matter. One, two, three. And then you could put another... One, two, three, cluster right here. So you should have about a one, like almost a full spiral stairs, uh, a full spiral uh, staircase going up, um, just like that. Uh, then you do the same exact thing again. This should be another three going up. So go up three by three cluster of stairs going up just like this like we've been doing everywhere else and then go one two three 
and then do that. And that, on this one, it should be perfectly lined up. And if it's not, then you might want to go recheck what you did. All right. So I believe that... So you want to count this. So you want to go all the way down to the end of this wall for three. And then you want to go from off this wall. One, two, three, four. And do that for three as well. Then you have to do one, oopsie, one, two, three, four, five, six, and bring those out for three. So you should have a six block um, thing right there, which is perfect. Oopsie. And then it should look exactly like that, which is amazing. That's what you want. And then at the top, you want to go... Yep, one, two, three, four. And bring this all over like that. Place two blocks. Actually, nope, don't do that. Then you want to build place a block to remove it. Go up by three. Go over all the way to the fourth. Go up like that. And like that. Make sure to put one piece of callus right there. This is just so you mark out where your door is going to be. And while you're up here, you can go put the door right there. So there you go. You got this side completely done. All you got to do is fill in the roof. But I'm going to do that later. So if I need to refer anything over here, it's a lot more accessible. Um, we, we will need to add the stairwell going all the way up. Which I found a really easy way to do it. So bear in mind with that. You could also, if you want to, just do this, just so it looks a little bit more presentable. Um, not that anyone's going to see it, but just for you while you're building it so your eyes are more uh, calmed. Now, let me go back all the way back to the back of my f the photos. And you do the same exact thing on this side. So you want to go all the way till it lines up to right here. Then bring this all the way back like this. All the way with your calcite. Perfect. Then go one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Roll away concrete. Then place a block to remove it. Go all the way down, leaving a three block gap. Then do that. Then do that once more. Now I'm gonna be a little bit smarter this time. And now from this from this block, you don't want to put anything here. Count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Then fill that all in. And perfect. Get green concrete. Bring that all the way down. Double stack it. Then put your white concrete. Then you want to go one, two, three. Fill that in. Throw up wood stairs. Then go. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Then you go up again. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. When I was first building this build, I actually was doing really bad. Um I completely messed up these stairs, but now that I have something to go off of, I am very confident in myself. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Another one again. Uh one two two, three, and my thing is all wearing off, okay, do it again, oopsie, oopsie, what am I doing, one, two, three, and then one, two, three, so you, it should be three blocks wide, three up, it should be, every time you go three up, put a block of three, uh, three by three, then go a block again, and go three again, and then up, so it should look just like that. And go one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Do the same thing pretty much with your stairs. Pretty much. So one, two, three. One, two, three. One. Or one, two, three. So once you get three stairs up, then you can go and fill this in straight to the wall like that. Now you can go fill all the way down here. Sorry about the background noise, that is kind of annoying. Um, my friend is spam texting me and calling me, so 
sorry about that in the background uh then when you want to, you want to go here the wall and then go one two three four and then fill that in for three blocks right there then you vote for six so it should be one oopsie one two three four five six double that out like this so that you could get that perfect you guys are doing amazing and then go out by another four one two three four for three blocks wide put your row of calcite then put one two three one two one two and actually over here break off that and then fill that and that's my mistake i am so sorry about that guys so you want to go like that instead and get your oak door or your dark oak door and put it exactly like that and that is amazing now you've marked out everything over here and that is brilliant it's very good and you should be very proud of yourself because when i was first building this it wasn't too pleasant and especially with the way i filled up these stairwells it was very disgusting so i'm gonna teach you a way easier and better way to do that so going over to the right stairwell that you did first go down over here and go one two three then go one two then go one two and then one so it should look like that then put a hole on it to fill that in then go just just go straight up right obviously um stopping at that same height um because you're gonna want to stop so build it just straight up to there so every single wall around that can get covered just like that and it's a lot faster and easier to do it this way and it'll cause um i guess less like disruptance with your brain because of how confusing it can be to do this and it's saving you actually a lot of time um in this world i have mods not mobs not spawning so i don't need to fill in the centerpiece but if you want to and it'll make it easier then that is good for you guys to do that so now when you're kind of walking up you can notice that this wall's already there and now you may be asking yourself hey joseph how do we do the rest be patient i got you but before we do that before we get anything else confused what we want to do is go over here place a block to destroy it and we want to work on our white ceiling over here for this part that we skipped on because i needed it for reference um to double check all my work uh but you can just fill that in now and cover all of this up now you don't need to go over these white pillars it doesn't really matter you can if you want but you know and if you might be asking me hey what are you gonna do with all this extra room i don't know yet i'll probably make a tutorial for something later on in the future but yeah right now there's um nothing for it so yeah all right continuing you want to get your green concrete go up to this one and go straight across until you reach one over at the edge of that and then continue like that actually when you get to about here leave three block gap go like this then go straight up like that obviously you can obviously go over like that just so it looks a little bit more presentable when you're walking up this and you know you see it uh you can make the top this just so it's a little bit neater now knowing this information we can just build up like this and honestly this looks a lot better than my previous stairwell the other one just kind of a hot mess and this one's more organized and more open i would say and not as confusing as what you might see um yeah so you want to just fill all this up just like that and that will look amazing it will look amazing guys so fill all this up and then you can go over it with your white concrete to make it the top part just like that and then you just want to bring it all the way down so the far you can bring it down um all the way depending on how far you want to bring it down um but then you will have to just uh when you get to about here you have to add another part there so this this one part over here that just branches off you don't need that 
Uh, forget about that part and fill this in up here. Uh, I know this is a little bit confusing, um, but if you just keep along, it will make sense. So, when you're done, okay, it's going to be a little bit hard to explain, but you're done building this part, act like this was never here, right? Um, obviously you need something to go over there, so you just place two blocks to cover that, then go down to this one, put two, uh, row four, and you just bring those and connect those up, um, because, yeah, actually, to make that a little bit better looking, bring it up to the there. So, just like that. So, you have this row, and then you have another row right here. A little bit confusing, I know, but, you know, it's alright. I, I believe you guys can successfully build it, especially with my bad instructions. Um, like I say, every time. Make sure to uh, ask questions in the comments. Um, always free to uh, open questions, especially because these my instructions are very confusing, and I know people um, get very confused with me explaining things. Um, so now, when you go in your stairwell, you will see just a bunch of openness right here, which is fine. You just want to build over like this, go like that. Just want to take it piece by piece. So, obviously, it's a lot more neat. And the ceiling will be a lot higher than in the other stairwells. But, it looks a lot nicer and a lot better. Now, if you wanted to, you could always fill that part in with your oak right here. I mean, you don't have to. That's just because it's popping up. Um, but I'm going to do that. Because, um, yeah, it's pretty disgusting to see that popping through now you're actually gonna have to fill up this part which I forgot to mention which is fine and there you go now you're not gonna see the outside so it doesn't matter how disgusting this looks on the outside um, but now you got a really really shway uh, doorway hey I rhymed now if that's annoying you you can always break this you can break that and then put white there so you have a little bit more headroom. And there you go. That is the first stairwell of two done. Uh, but just make sure to fill this over. Um, with this. So obviously you're not looking up into literally nothingness. Uh, and you actually actually look somewhat presentable. Um, and you just go like this. Just like that. Just build this over. This tutorial is going to be a, it's a little bit more choppy than the other one. It's just a lot harder to explain how to do this. So if you are actually somewhat carrying along and seeing and understanding what I'm saying, congratulations to you. If you're very confused on this part, I'm going to go a lot slower on the second one. Because I know what I'm doing now and I actually didn't build that yet. So that was all coming off of my dome. Um, so, yeah. So, next one. I'm gonna go to the bottom. Go one, two, three. One, two, one, two, one. Put a block in the center. Then go straight up. Keeping aware of this line. And put a white concrete on top until it lines up. Do the same thing around for all of these. Just like that. All the way up to the top. Just like that's epic. So you want to do this. Looks beautiful. Beautiful, guys. Now, I think I might make this into three parts because it is very... I feel very bad keeping you for way too long on these videos. Uh, last one was the outside, and it was 40 minutes long when it shouldn't have been. So, I will leave the next spot for another one, um, obviously. Uh, so, yeah. So then, what you want to do is get your blocks. Go right here. Build all the way out to there. And it should line up with the other one. But build out a block. So you want to start on this, on the first row, going up. Connect it out. Leave it a block away. 
And then what you want to do is just go straight over. Build straight up. Like this. Leaving a one block gap. So it's not 100% lining up. But it still is. Now, I know they're not going to be super symmetrical. Depending on... Like, because I know for this one, I left the whole back open. But instead, I am actually filling this part in. Which, on the inside, you won't actually notice any of it. You won't notice it at all. But on the outside, it'll just look a little different. Um, which is fine, because you're not going to see it anyways. But, just thought I should point that out in case... You know, so it'll be two different methods. Whatever one you find easier, you can do. So with this extra block of gap, fill in your white concrete. Just like that. Then you want to bring up this green row. That's doing amazing. Then it should interfere. But like I did before, the line block starts about here. You don't have to start it from there. Obviously, it doesn't matter. Uh, you can start it from actually just right here. Uh, go all the way. Go out that far. And then just go up. And then do that. Um, obviously, it's not going to look the same on the outside for both of them. These are two different methods you could do this. I would say this method that I'm doing right now is a lot easier. So you can use this on both sides. But it's really not going to matter um, in the end. Because they're both going to look the same on the inside. So, perfect. And then you want to go on the row above. Three, one, two, three. Um, and then one, two, three. Then you're going to go like that. So it should look, it should be like four across on each one. I think this is the same. It's five. Okay. So you actually want to go out one more. And then you could fill in this whole roof. But what I would do first before that is um, go down here and fill in your ceiling and then cover up any other gaps you may have um in the in the in that build um so just like this perfect well i have to get underneath again so when you're done filling up all this roof like i said before on the other one if you don't like that, you could always go out one, put a block, and then just go like that. And then you could... Let me just double check on this model. Um, because I did end up um, doing something with that ceiling on the bottom, which I don't remember what I did. Uh, I just connected it up. So what you'll do is just um, connect that bad boy up um, to the ceiling. Uh... So, break that row, then just do this. And that is looking very, very good. Perfect, guys. And there you have it. Now, like I said before, you could fill... Oh, yeah. One more thing you gotta do is fill in this row right here. Because you don't want anyone uh, just randomly falling off of your, uh, your stairwell. Definitely gonna get sued if you have that. And like I said, you could just fill this part in. Because it looks a little bit ugly. Um, but yeah. Then you just want to fill in all of this. Just all of this. Let's get it all filled. And then you are pretty much done this. But we do have to add some final, final finishing touches. So what you'll need is two more materials. What you'll need is a sea lantern. And some iron trap doors. The trap doors are optional. I like them because we're kind of in a place of business. And it just looks kind of better, in my opinion. So, coming in on the door, you're going to go one, two, three. Put a cluster of three, just like that. I'm going to do the same on this side as well, so I don't forget later. One, two, three. Put a cluster, just like that. And you guys, it's looking amazing. Then you want to go from... Oopsie. My night vision running out. Then you want to go from two blocks in. You want to go... Actually, like this. And then leave a one block gap in between it all. Oopsie. Make sure you um, 
don't break anything else like I am doing right now. Go like exactly like that so it looks like a spiral. And that is epic. Just like this. And then put trapdoors all the way around on top of this. I got this design from Wheel Assassin. Um, fairly cool YouTuber. Makes really good tutorials. And that's why I am subscribed to him. Currently walking on his uh, Starcourt mall that he made. So, I'll check him out. I'll have him linked in the description. I'll have him tagged. He's obviously just an amazing, an amazing uh, YouTuber. One of the good ones. Um, and yeah. So, I would, I would check him out if you haven't already. Uh, he will be linked in the description for this tutorial. And there you go. And this will be um, part two of the build. As you can see, we built the lobby. Um, we built everything else on the inside. And next time we'll be working on the whole main center part of the precinct or of CCPD. So thank you all for watching so much. Hope you really enjoyed this video. I, I am very excited that you came to come watch. And I can't wait to see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful rest of your day.